napkins. Oh, those are cool. You can get under the camera so you can see them. <gasps> Look at that! That was the back of them, I guess. Holy crap! I've never seen metallic napkins before. Never ever. That is stinking cool. Never seen those in my life. Oh, here's some postcards that look like they are actual postcards, not like... <gasps> look at these. They're pinups. Oh, man. Oh, these are from 1995. Oh, I thought they were older than that. They're pinups. Oh, my goodness. Reefer girl. Look at that. Lasts longer than your attention span. Starburst. <laughs> That's funny. And this one. Oh, cool. Yeah, I love pinups. I also am collecting stuff to... I used to have pinup pictures all over my bedroom. Because I love, like, vintage pinups. And I had a bunch of them all over, like, prints that were actually worth something all over my bedroom. And I had to pack them up because I started packing my bedroom up a while ago. And now I wish I still had them out because I kind of miss them. Beauty and the Beast. Yeah, because every time I would go to the flea market, this guy, he would sell reprints of... Um, that were actually, they actually were worth a little bit of money, not much, but they were reprints of uh, original artwork from like the 50s, and they were pretty cool. Very cool. These are really cool. Oh, I love this. God Save the Queen. That's funny. I love that. <laughs> these are cool. Look at these. These look, <gasps> these are old. Are they old? Are these like really old? I don't have my glasses on, so I can't see, but are these, like, genuinely old? I think they are. Oh, my goodness. That is so cool. <gasps> Look at, these are in plastic, so you know these are damn old. Oh, my goodness. These are, like, legit. 1910. How the hell did you give these up? Oh, my goodness. Look at that. These are from 1910, and they will stay in the plastic forever and a day, because I will keep them. I, 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 when it comes to old stuff like this, I can't, I just can't do anything but keep them in their original plastic and what have you. Oh my goodness, this is so cool. It doesn't have a date on it. I have to put things down on the floor for now. This is so crazy. 1909, I think it says. I can't almost read it. This is so stinking cool. Look at this, a metallic. I didn't know they could do that back in 1909. That is so cool. These are amazing, 1910. I'm gonna have to sit and try to read all of this. Oh, this one's metallic too. Happy birthday. Oh, I love these. Oh my goodness. 1910. Oh, look at the little dog. So cool. Oh my goodness. These are amazing. Oh, these are like this and like, oh my goodness. You just sent me like a treasure box. I can't believe this. Hello, Dorothy. How are you? Why do you not come to see me sometime? From Aunt... Something. <laughs> Look at that. That's gorgeous. Gorgeous. 1919. Best wishes of the season. Must be Christmas, yeah. So cool. So stinking cool. To Mary from Annie. And that's it. That's all they write. To Mary from Annie. <laughs> a New Year's card. Oops. New Year's postcard. That's funny. Well, this one. This one's really written on. Wow. They didn't leave any space on that side to undone. They definitely wrote all over it. 1918. Best wishes. Very cool. Oh, no. Get back here. Oh, goodness. Um, let's see. I don't know what the date is on that one, but... Isn't that cool? It's a birthday. Oh, I gotta sit back a second. Mmm. Drink time. 
These are amazing. So amazing. I can look at these forever. Birthday. Something. I can't read that. The writing is really like weird back then. This is birth, love, something. I don't know. 1912. Well, it's Christmas, so I don't think it's a birth announcement. <laughs> 1910. From I'm a Riddle. Ah. What? That's weird. Birthday greetings. Very cool. These are gorgeous. 1910. Birthday greetings. Birthday greetings. <laughs> gorgeous, gorgeous. I don't know the date on these, but they don't have postage on them. Birthday greeting, but probably around the same time. And these ones don't have plastic. <gasps> oh, what is this? Printed in Mexico. It's definitely like vintage, but it's very cool. I love this one. This one's amazing. It's fuzzy. Look at that. It's definitely vintage. You can tell by the card. I've never seen anything like that. That is a treasure. I love that one. Look at this one, too. Oh, my goodness. These are gorgeous. These are gorgeous. They're fuzzy. That's so amazing. Look at that. Oh my goodness, look at that picture. Oh, so cool. So cool. Oh, look at that one. It's an, a vintage Asian postcard. Isn't that cool? Oh my goodness. <gasps> I'll have a hard time putting that into my Asian journal just because I know it's... It, well, as long as it's my journal, I can leave it in the little plastic sleeve and put it in. But, yeah. There's these in here, which are every good wish. These are amazing. Look at these. Happy New Year. Amazing. These are so beautiful. They don't make stuff like this anymore. Beautiful. Let me put this back in the plastic. I don't want to get too much acid for my fingers on them, that's for sure. And I'm going to put those other ones, those Mexican ones, in plastic as well. Um, but that's it. Thank you so much. This was amazing. Such an amazing box of goodies. I can't even believe it. I'm like in love. I can't believe you shared any of this stuff with me. It's really amazing. Thank you so much, Laura. So sweet of you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And thank you so much, Janie, for that mug. I love that mug. It is so stinking cute. I can't believe you found a mug with fingers. <laughs> That's so funny. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'm sorry I was in a weird position and all that stuff. Um, hopefully soon I'll be back at my desk and uh, feeling better, hopefully. I just have to wait and to find out what's going on on Monday and um, see what's what. And hopefully they don't need to admit me or anything. Hopefully they can just take care of it without that, as that would be great because I was tempted to go to the hospital earlier, but then I started to feel a little bit better. Just enough where I felt like, okay, I don't really think I need to go right now. Um, so hopefully I stay feeling a slightly better. Um, I definitely don't feel good, but I feel just better enough where I can, st I think I could stay away from the ER is what I mean. Uh, earlier I did not feel that way. I actually felt like I was going to be going to the ER any minute. Um, but anyway, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this happy mail. Thank you so much to Laura and Janie for sending me this amazing happy mail. I hope that um, 
I hope that I'll be back to a little bit more normalcy soon. And that's it. I'll talk to you later. Please give it a thumbs up if you liked the stuff that I got. And subscribe if you're not subscribed. And I will talk to you later. Make sure you do what you love and love what you do. And be nice to people. Bye.